so what is this service? How are how are we? You know, we're all part of the mystery school, and then you know, to take it a, uh, to a further extent, you're you're all divinas. But what do you really see is the service? What is the service that not only every initiate is doing, but even the service that that you all are doing as well? Because everybody can hit that level of service, but what is it that they're striving for, or what's possible in their service? Okay, I'll go. <laughs> so I um, the I never thought in my wildest dreams that I would be one of the divinas, and I still have a hard time bending my mind around it, being a divina. But I have found that this path has taken me from what I thought to what I could never imagine. And service uh, is what did it. Now, service is not that easy to describe, but it's that passion to take what you have received and share it with everybody else. And that really is what my journey has all been about. When I came to the school, I was the greatest skeptic. I would think, you know, uh, you would be hard pressed to find somebody as skeptical as I was. But I took this work back to my medical practice and I started using it for my patients and I saw change that was incredible and change that I wanted to see in my patients and my clients where they started taking responsibility for themselves. They didn't come to me to fix them or change things for them. So for me, service is taking what you have received and sharing it with everybody. And then it leads you to this, leads you to this role. <laughs> yeah. And I want to, you know, add to that. <clears throat> you know, I think, you know, for myself, and if I can speak on, you know, on behalf of the other Davinas, you know, we at least, every single one of us had that one thought of, you know, in our life, asking ourselves, who, who am I? What am I here to do? And, you know, when we all found this path all at separate times, it, it was that, you know, that mind chatter, almost that mind chatter that, or that little, you know, that little nudge saying, yes, you, you should go there. If you're asking yourself this question, you know, who am I? You will, you can, and you will find your answers. And <clears throat> service is part of that. Service is definitely part of that because we have to serve ourselves. But within that, we are wanting something more in our world. We are not only seeking, but we are wanting. We are wanting something more so it can become a better place. And we want to become better human beings. So in, in, and, in, and in the knowledge that we gain, then service comes from that. Because then we can go out into the world, like Davina Rita was saying, you know, she was bringing it to her patients and she was seeing so much change in them. Well, we want to bring the training and the knowledge that we know out into the world because we saw the change in ourself and we want to bring it out to others. And, <clears throat> you know, we're on a mission. We are definitely on a mission. Being here, whatever you want to call it, you want to call Modern Mystery School an institute or it, it's... It's a place for many that is home. Uh, you know, a lot of us like to call it a temple of knowledge. So we love to come here and get the training and receive the knowledge so we can better ourselves and then go out and serve others with it. So it's really to bring opportunity and to allow people, bring growth to people's lives. And I think for me, it's interesting what you say, because for me, I always, always seeking joy. You know, I, I could never find this joy, this something that would fulfill me. And it was service that actually brought me the joy. I'd never experienced it before. Yeah, I'd been happy, I'd been excited. And I, you know, I was an adrenaline junkie and I did everything you could possibly imagine to try and get that high of what I thought joy was. And I looked for a long time and I didn't know until I went to Healers Academy actually. And I did this life activation 
uh, you know, and uh, all of a sudden something started to change within me and I, I, it started to fill me with this fulfillment and this joy that I, I couldn't replicate anywhere else. And all of a sudden, my depression, my negative thoughts, my anxiety, all the things that I suffered from, you know, uh, you know, as a student, when I first came to the mystery school, trying to, you know, seek, trying to solve this problem that I, that I had, it was service that was it. And then from there, everything is a byproduct. So what I found, as, as you know, I'm an entrepreneur, and what I found is that the more service I did, everything in my life grew. Everything expanded. Everything I touched was a success. And I just, I, I couldn't believe it. I was like, oh my goodness, is this, is, that, is this it? Is it's, like, it's like the Midas touch. When, you, when you're in full service, everything, <coughs> everything flows. Your relationships flow better. The way that you think about yourself feels great. Your health, I mean, it literally for me was overflowing with this joy that I, had never experienced before.